Okay, hop. Oh, you're working on a new guitar thing. That's nice. Hold on, everybody. Sorry, we're back. There was a blackout, but it was quick. Thank God. This is uh, episode two, part two. So, Lolo, you're telling us you're working on some new songs on the guitar, huh? That's good. Acoustic prog rock. And where can people find this wonderful, your wonderful pieces of art when it comes to music? You don't understand. I am baiting you into letting me know how I can share your music with the world. Okay, so I'm the idiot. You're being Charles de Gaulle. Je vous ai compris. That's what he said when they said, like, Algeria should be independent. He's like, je vous ai compris. <laughs> Doesn't mean I agree with it, though. I understood you. I still don't agree. <laughs> yeah. Sorry, history nerd reference. Um, yeah. I love that quote. It, for those of you who are listening, it means, like, I understood you. That's what he said. When uh, Algeria was actually not even a French colony, it was... Beyond that, it was a French department. It was like a county. Let's put it that way, uh, like a state, a region. Yeah, it didn't have the state, the uh, status of colony, Algeria. C'était un département, and uh, it just happened to be on the other side of the pond, the Mediterranean. And when they were saying, "Yeah, Algeria should be, uh, should not be French, should be independent," blah blah blah, the great leader Charles de Gaulle just says, "I understood you," <laughs> and that's it. Um, it's like, I hear you guys, but then again, I disagree. I do understand. I do not approve. <laughs> I think it's fair. I mean, like, it's very, it's especially fair if you believe someone's fighting for their, what they believe is right, you know. Um, you can empathize and sympathize with those principles, even if you disagree on what, you know, the reason that they're fighting about. Yeah. Yeah. Mm-hmm. Some people don't have empathy. Oh, shit. I wasted my bullets. Now I'm fucked. I mean, uh, Christian fundamentalists and ISIS have so much in common. <laughs> uh, yeah, yeah, of course. That's that's what exactly what I'm saying. Um, now we gotta go to the subway office. Which is... Oh, I, I, I took the stairs. I shouldn't have... Okay, I, I'm gonna take the donut shop then. Go this way. It's easier. Oh, fuck you, dude. Honestly. Fuck you guys. Fuck! I'm getting... E okay, hold on. Cause I, I made it... No, I'm gonna die. I, I'm gonna die real quick. Yeah. Oh, look at that. No, it's impossible. Yeah. Yeah. Some people might get upset. How can you say Christian fundamentalists that I have so much in common? Look, radical beliefs without questioning, you know, uh, is all very similar across the board. I mean, there's a reason why uh, 1984 and... Um, yeah, I mean, not, I think it's either 1984 or... No, I think it was Animal Farm. Either way, one of the Orwell books. It was illegal in the Soviet Union because it was deemed capitalist and fascist. 
and it was illegal in fascist countries and also uh, in other places because it was considered communist. So the communists thought it was fascist and the fascists thought it was communist, which is, uh, you know, a hilarious predicament when you think about it. Uh, and not even ironic. I mean, economically speaking, they were, but when it comes to socially speaking, uh, socially speaking, they're not on the left at all. Uh, yeah. But, you know, you, you do understand that in the U.S., even if you take more um, socially... social people... But there's a difference between economically, like in terms of the market and everything, and then socially. Socially liberal or economically liberal, right? And in Europe, the definition of uh, conservative and liberal tends to, be, um, tends to be the economic thing, because the social one is not even a thing. Of course, we're going to be socially liberal in, in Europe in many places and countries. Um, like, it's not even up to discussion. Like, if Obama was a, a candidate in Europe, he would be considered to be on the right. That simple, like absolutely on the right. So like the spectrum is so narrow, you know, that's part of the problem. Oh my God, this guy is so annoying. I swear, but am I dead again? No, not yet. Oof. Yeah. Um, me, as well as a lot of people have struggled with this part of the game, uh, which is trying to just get past this asshole. Uh, Yes, I am, but sometimes he doesn't go there. And I only have like one bullet left. Yeah. But to bait him, oh, Karasas. He has to come close, and if he comes close enough, he can just pull me in. Uh, dude, you know what I feel like doing? I almost feel like asking you to look online what's the code of that vault, you know? What's the code for that chest? Oh, oh, oh shit, oh shit, oh shit. Whoop. The oh, he's coming again. All right, Lolo, help me out. Let's cheese this bullshit. What's the what's the the combination for this chest? Oh shit, he's coming this way. I didn't know that he could come here. Resident Evil three chest combination. Yeah, safe combination. Um. Downtown. Okay, back again. Uh, yeah, I think so. I mean, Mr. X is here now, so I'm just gonna... Turn on these things, and then on the way back, keep that page open. Okay. On the way back, I'll, um... Ah, but it might be somewhere in here. Oh, but I'm not trying. Yeah, I think that's the one I did last time, actually. The one you're saying now. Ah, oh, beautiful. Some safes have, uh, there's two safes sometimes. Like, if it's the one in the police station, or, or, or the other one. Uh, control panel, okay. Activate. Oh, okay. The train is stopped at Redstone Street. We need to reach Fox Park Station. Can you program? Hey, I'm sure the map. Autobots roll out. Redstone Street, zero one, okay. And then it's 
fast something. Mm, F A fast what? Zero zero what? Zero two probably. Raccoon Central Station. Yeah, I kind of I am. Are so that's no not the safe. Are you looking at the Twitch stream? What I'm doing? Ah, okay. Yeah, I, I'm trying to. And the yeah, it's R A. That's one, so two, I guess, or three. Uh, yeah, right? No. Yeah, three, 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 three. And it's going to be Saint Michael's. <laughs> uh, and Fox is going to be two, I think. Unable to establish route. St. Michael's SA2. Okay. Return. Valid route confirmed. Carlos, it's me. I finished him putting something. We got it. Okay, super. Tough as nails, too. Hurry back to the station. We'll make sure the subway's ready to depart. Well, you mean the last decade of the analog? The noughties, if you really want to push it for some people. Um. Ah, oh, shit. Yeah, we are the last, uh... Nah, but it took some time. Digital took took some time. And then, the la over the last 10 years, it's just... Exploded. Like, when we were kids, we had the same thought as our parents, I think. Like, technology... In the future, we would picture hardware, right? But what actually happened was software. Um, the big revolution, right? The big things where you can notice the difference because the formula for the hardware is still the same. Computers, aside from the flat screen, still kind of look the same and operate the same way. And Windows 95 is not very different from the Windows we have nowadays. Ah, oh, beautiful. Look at that shit. Um, it, is, it's, it does feel odd when you go back and try to use Windows 95, but... Oh, shit. Uh, the Windows the tablets have? I don't know. It's now we're on Windows uh, eight and ten. The tablets, yeah, yeah, yeah. Y yeah. You mean the the mosaic tile? Yeah, yeah. Mosaic tile uh, thing. I feel you. Okay, now I gotta go to... Okay, there's a safe here. The, the mosaic thing? I think it came with Windows 8. Um, so around 20... Uh, 10, 12, I don't know. Shit, I'm out of bullets. Fuck. I hate being out of bullets. Feel like a fucking loser. But... We're gonna go here and maybe there's some bullets inside this thing. Cause now we got a lockpick. We can open whatever we want. Hand grenade. Cool. Not that I care. But thanks, I guess. And I have four bullets left in all of my arsenal. Four shotgun shells. And... Oh, let's go back to that safe. Let's go back to that safe. The one uh, in the building up there. I mean... <laughs> you gotta go to our safe space. Okay, if we get touched one more time, we die. Okay, he's gone, and we have no more bullets. They're very annoying, persistent, yeah. I don't like them. Yeah, I don't like them. 
I do not like them one bit. Okay, so what did you say? Um, nine left, right? Ah, shit. I gotta go again. Cancel. So, nine left. Okay, that's it. Nine left. Okay, that's it. Nine left. And then what? One right? Okay. And then? No. Mm-hmm. That's more like it. And then? And seven left. Yay! It was. Oh no, we cheated. Uh, we're, we didn't cheat, because the first time I played this around, I actually found the combination written somewhere. Um, even though last stream I said, we're gonna play this as if it was the first time. That was yesterday. Maybe today I don't feel like playing like it's the first time. You know? Sometimes I change my mind about things. And that's okay, you know, and that's okay. What about consistency, bro? Gotta stick to your beliefs, bro. Okay. And I still believe in Santa, because you gotta stick to your beliefs and convictions. Yeah, man. Gotta, you know, stick to your guns. Ride or die. <laughs> I God. Can you imagine if I actually live my life like that? Good lord. Okay, the asshole is back, and we really have to make it to the subway station. We really have to make it behind that car over there. Oh shit. Here he is. Oh, oh okay, now everybody's coming at me. All at once. Fucking great. Get off. Where's my grenade? Okay. Fuck all of you. Where's the cop car? Am I going the right way? No, I went the wrong way. Oh, look, supply. Okay, cool. I don't need this now. Let me just... Okay. It's time to sprint. Lolo, I think we can make it. Let's go. Let's go. Oh, no, not this way. He's still down. And he's up again. Please don't come in... Oh, shit. We got no... Okay, I guess it's a knife then. No. Move, bitch. Ugh. I did try to fight her with a knife, though. I don't get it. What the fuck? Yeah, but I I'm pressing A to attack the guy with my knife, and it does nothing. Like, he just... Yeah, it's weird. It just, like, stabs the air, and that's it. Ooh, so close. So close. Thank the Lord. What's in here? Examine. Open. What's this? Great. I don't need any of this. Really, I need life. I mean, I want it. I like it. Don't get me wrong. But I could really use... Is there a locker anywhere here? Should be. Yeah, exactly. We need some locker. Locker room talk. That's exactly what I'm trying to bring up. Where's the lockers? Ah, uh, here's a box. I found one, yeah. Let's open it, see what's inside. Dun dun dun, shotgun shells, okay. Not exactly what I was hoping for, but it will still save my life. Um, this playthrough is more difficult than my original playthrough. <laughs> like, when you're actually trying to do things properly, and, uh, you know, trying to move a bit more. You end up making more mistakes. And I used my herb. Because I had to. Um, anything in this safe that I could use? I'll take the gunpowder out. And the hand grenade too. Because if I get some gunpowder I can combine it. Um, I shouldn't get rid of those yet. But we're going to move them here. Okay. And we're going to save.
all the way down here because it's a risky save. Mm? I have still one free. Because if I find gunpowder, then I can just make ammo immediately. Oh, but I do have... Oh, actually, I'm being silly. One, two, three. Ah, there's still one left. Yeah, I just shoot the shotgun one. I I'm going to get rid of the knife, man, because the knife is fucking useless, let's be honest. It's only good for opening crates. Yeah, yeah, it's very frustrating. There's a difference between challenge uh, and frustration. And in this case, it's just frustration. Because you, you saw me trying to stab the zombie. You know, it's like I had an airplane knife. Yeah. Because usually, it, it should you should be able to... In Resident Evil 2, when they come close to you, and you have a knife equipped, you can stab the knife in their head and then escape, and once you kill that particular zombie, you can get your knife back. But in this case, no. And in Resi 2, the survival knife has a certain amount of hits. Yeah. So I don't know if it's a mistake here, but it's not working. Yeah. But that's fine. I don't mind if the knife breaks, but I just like l give me something to use it for besides boxes. Um Nice job, Super Cop. I'm impressed. We back in business? Yeah, mostly. But we need 30 to 40 minutes to finish maintenance. Nikolai. How are we doing? The town's crawling with those freaks. No chance of fighting our way out of the city. Why is she here? Cutscene. She's helping me get the trains running again. Bad time to start getting dead weight for it. She's unreliable. I know, right? It's all over the place. Take it easy. She'll get you killed. Yeah. <laughs> Sorry about And it's not over his eyes, even though it looks like it should be over his eyes. I don't understand. How could, like, that's not very good for visibility. Not again. Um, in his situation, but it's not over his eyes, it's so me, technically you can still shoot properly. Hey, I'll buy you some time. Hey, wait. Wait, Jill. No, Go. Jill, you fucking moron! What are you doing? Uh, okay, super, on, great. You I thought about that once. Alolo just said maybe apocalypse survivors only feel alive if they can be in another apocalypse situation. And uh, I, I think that's kind of, you know, true. Oh, okay, and we're fucked now. Like, we're proper fucked. Unless. Yeah, we're like stuck here. Up. <laughs> oh, I killed myself. Fucking great. It needed a bit more. Okay, let's try again one more time. Um. And we'll try to move to the next area of the game. And when we do that, we save and get the fuck out. It's been a productive day. But quite difficult, let's be honest. Come on, you creepy ass stalker. You want stars? I'll give you stars. You want stars? I'll give you stars. Ah! Ow. Okay. Grab the ammo and get the fuck out. Up oh, here it is. Here it is. Grenade. Where is he? Uh oh. No, no, no. He was no he oh god uh like I'm sprinting away after he hits me once. But I'm kind of like, quote-unquote, stunned, staggered or whatever, and then he hits me again. So, like, what's the pr 
Like, then just kill me immediately. You know what I mean? What's the point of staggering me and then hitting me again? If I'm gonna die anyway. The fuck are you talking about? <laughs> Nonsense. Okay, so, um... Uh. Okay, now we couldn't even... Did we get the first spray? Yeah, we did. Yeah, I did earlier as well, but didn't slow him down much. Faster? Maybe. Come on, Jill! Oh, great, beautiful. Fucking great. Uh. Yeah, but the first time I did this, I just went through. You know? Like, I just decided not to grab the ammo and I went for it immediately. Um... Yeah. See, he just got me again. Like I'm okay. I'm and I'm dead. Oh, I'm not. Look at that. And you gotta do the perfect parry. Yeah, but it's not. I'm not the only one complaining about this in this game. Like other people have made similar observations. Yeah, yeah with the fact that sometimes the pursuits with the nemesis are kind of broken. Like, this is some bullshit. How much money you bet we're gonna die right now? Ah, are we gonna manage? Ah, we will. Okay. Yeah, this is what I did last time. So if I don't go for the ammo... I think maybe when you touch the ammo, Nemesis, like, it, they make them make him run faster or ac activate behind you, you know what I mean? Um, something like that. Okay. Oh, we can discard these things. We don't need it anymore. Boom. Bolt cutters. Bye-bye. Don't need it anymore. Use. Up. We got four shotgun shells, and that's it. And now we're going to move on to the sewers, which is a part that I barely explored last time. Because I was very annoyed at a special type of enemy you find in the sewers, who make your journey very, very difficult. We're out of range. I need to find another way out. Okay. Sewers map. Awesome. A map of the area. Red herb. Awesome. Not that I have a green herb, but maybe we'll find one here. Handgun ammo. Beautiful. Shotgun shells. Beautiful. Look at that. So, we can put this here. Actually, I'm going to keep the red herb just in case we run into a green one. And we can use this. Up. Great. Super. Okay, everybody. Uh, I think we're going to leave it at this because it's already 10 to 11 for me. So we'll do the sewers tomorrow. Either tomorrow or after tomorrow. Uh, I think this was productive. Right, Lolo? We advanced a little bit. We went to kill those creepy spiders. We escaped Nemesis. You know? So, I think it's fine. Let's go up. Awesome. Thank you, everybody, for watching. Sorry for all the issues and problems, but... Uh, it happens. It's internet, blackouts. We're very far away from each other, Lolo and I. So, hopefully tomorrow everything will work better. Go check out Dagon underscore Keldrum on Twitch, um, also on YouTube, um, and go check out on Twitch the underscore Jack Reinhardt, and on YouTube Jack and Papu, that's uh, P4PU. Bye bye everybody, have a good evening, take care.
See you tomorrow or soon. Mwah.